what's up girlies and my name is Deidre for those of you who don't know and welcome or welcome back to my channel new year is upon us and I just want to go over my favorite scent for 2023 I love these scents they did a good job but I now want to level up a little bit but I didn't want to level up without telling y'all my favorite scents of 2023 like this video subscribe to my channel comment down below let me know what you want to see or what you like about my video and let's get into the video first scent is an oldie but goodie the victoria's secret bombshell i still have a little bit of this i try not to use it that much um because you know when you like something you just don't use it as much so victoria's secret bombshell will always be a favorite especially in my early 20s now i'm mid 20s so it's like kind of uh but i did like this scent it carried me through many years and this is a little bit left of the bottle so yeah victoria's secret bombshell did me good it's just that type of musk scent in a good way in a good way um but i do like this scent so victoria's secret bombshell i will rate this out of 10 i will rate this a 7 out of 10 a 7 a cool 7 out of 10 is a sheer love by victoria's secret as well this scent is a clean scent um i will use this when i get out the shower or clean scent so i like this scent for just one of those days where i want to feel fresh i feel like will i restock on this no like i feel like this is going to take me pretty far because i don't wear it that often right now 10 i'll give it a 7.5 out of 10 it's not a bad scent it don't stink or nothing like that i feel like it's good for layering but it's just it's okay it's not like one of them ones you know like it's okay nice clean scent dreams by victoria's secret Wicked Dreams have been that girl, honey, going out to the club, Wicked Dreams, pulling all the men, all them dudes, Wicked Dreams. Wicked Dreams was one of them ones. I would rate this a 9 out of 10 because for a cheap perfume that was probably $4, Wicked Dream was one of them ones. I don't know if they still have it in store or not. If, it's, if it is, girl, go get some Wicked Dreams because this is a nine out of ten for me like this is one of the ones especially when you layer it one of the ones like wicked dreams one of the ones it's uh an expensive type of perfume this is a carolina herrera good girl gone bad perfume y'all this is a 10 out of 10 this perfume smells so good y'all it's barely something in here like I don't even know if there's anything in here left, but this perfume, 10 out of 10. I got the mini version because I wanted to test it, but it's so soft and feminine and just like has a hint of vanilla in it. It smells so good. This is a 10 out of 10. I definitely will be repurchasing this in the future. I want to get the one that's pink too, but I would definitely purchase this version again. 10 out of 10 recommend. You got to go get it because it's like one of my favorite scents that I will continue wearing past 2023. Is I haven't had this one for that long, but this is the Tom for Soul Blanc Shimmering Body Oil. Yo, this smell like the St. Bart's um, scrub by Way. It smells exactly like that. So imagine pairing both those two. Yo, it has a soft vanilla like scent. It smells like that scrub. Like, yo, 10 out of 10 recommend. It was only $100. Um, I think I got it from Nordstrom Rag. I think I got it from Nordstrom. Or I got it from Saks. I got it from Saks. Yo, it smells so good. It was the last one. Um, the shimmer, it's not like a cheap shimmer either. Like, you'll find it like a dollar store. Like, it's quality shimmer. Don't have you itchy and shit. Like, it's it's really good quality. I would recommend this 10 out of 10. Especially if you layer it with that scrub. You do that scrub first and then you do this. And then you do, do this. Girl, you are snatching somebody's man or your man is going to eat you up, honey. Like, they're going to eat you up because this, that, these two together and with the sugar scrub and your skin is all soft on vacation in the hot sun. Yo. You're going to be pregnant. You're going to have baby. It's going to have color finger thing. Just let it, just let it happen. Like, don't, don't try to stop it. Just 
just let it happen. So the next thing that we got, the next perfume is the Sol de Janeiro 68. I love this perfume. I was working at Sephora at the time. If you don't know, I used to work at Sephora. And I always used to see Sol de Janeiro, but I was always thought I couldn't afford it or it wasn't worth buying. So I was going through smelling the scents because I'm at work and ain't nothing to do. So I was going through smelling and this one like caught my attention so much like middle schoolers was going in here buying this and i'm like what what these middle schoolers are going in here buying this for like what's going on like so i smelled it girl like yo this if i was in middle school this would change the game and i wouldn't stop using it either like this would change the game it smells so good i wear this to work almost every single day because it lasts so long for it to be around 20 to 30 dollars i got the big size um it lasts a really long time and that really surprised me but it's really really good the body cream with this i like that body cream rather than the orange one just because it's a little thicker consistency and it just smells so good so it's like layering your scents make it last longer but with me spraying this and i work 12 hour shifts it lasts the whole entire day so 10 out of 10 definitely would recommend the 68 sol j janeiro perfume get the get the scrub get lotion get whatever you need to get to layer because this 10 out of 10 oh yeah so thank you so much for watching my videos and thank you so much for liking my videos subscribing to my channel like i really uh, greatly appreciate it and that's all the scents that i like for 2023 that's all my favorite scents for 2023 and we will see you in the new year i don't know if this video is going to be posted in the new year or not but yeah let's see what scents 2024 holds and what snack we're gonna be smelling like a snack in 2024 so it doesn't even matter but thank you so much for watching this video like comment subscribe on the channel and we'll see you in the next video bye girl Oh